Welcome to our first video tutorial covering Adobe InDesign. In this tutorial we will go over how to go through the welcome window in InDesign. When you guys first open up InDesign, this is what you'll see. On the left side you have open a recent item. Once you have saved a document, it'll appear on this side. However, since we have not created anything, let's look at the create new. You can create a new document new book or a new library. Whenever you guys open up InDesign and want to create a new assignment or a new project, please always select the document. So again, under Create New and Document. Once you select Document, this is the new document window that pops up. At the very top, you have Document Preset. You have Default, which is the settings you see below. You can also change it to Custom if you like to have a specific document preset. Intent. If you guys want to have it for print based or web based, in this class I'd like you to keep everything at print. Number of pages. Currently for this assignment I want you guys to only focus on opening up one page. However, later on in the semester and in the year you're going to create some projects that have more than one page. And that's where start page number comes in. If you have numerous pages you can select where you want the document to open up on. Page size. In this drop-down menu, you see letter, legal, tabloid, letter half, legal half. The letter is the typical 8.5 by 11 inches. You can also choose down here A5, A4, U.S. business card, or compact disc. So let's stick with the letter. Then you can do width and height. These are actually in picas instead of inches. In a different video, I'll show you how to transfer the units and increments from picas to inches. Orientation. You can leave it as portrait or as landscape. Some projects you prefer to use landscape, others you prefer to use portrait. In this case, I would like for you guys to use portrait. You can, always, you can also change the columns for number and gutter and also the margins. Once you're done with that, hit OK. And that is how you open up and create a new document in InDesign. 